Chris, just uh, I guess, how do you digest that one? I mean, rough first half, and then to see your yeah other guys really come through in the second there. Yeah, you know, I mean, um, I think uh, you know our first unit was out there kind of playing not to get hurt, and uh, it's always the danger of these types of things. So, um, but really proud of the way the the bench unit you know fought and came back and gave it gave it gave it effort and you know tried to make it a game. Did make it a game. What do you think, just to see Nate Knight do that yeah. the way that he did? I mean, happy to see him be able to put kind of that, that stuff out there in, in kind sure. of his last game. I mean, he's a, you know, I've said all season, he's an NBA player. You know, there have been times maybe we should have played him more. Um, you know, we're so, we're so like, uh, kind of, we have a lot of depth at the other end of the lineup. So it forces us, you know, forces Jaden McDaniels down to the four more. Cat obviously plays 36 a night. Um, you know, Vando. Uh, so we got a lot of guys, and Torian had played well. So it's it's been really hard to find him just like a role, you know. Um, but we've been impressed with him all season long, and uh, he's always made something happen and just love the impact that he has of the physicality and stuff. So I know it's still – you still got another day, but do you feel ready for – Tuesday in terms of the way this team is playing and what you what do you expect in that game? Yeah, I mean, I think we're ready. I mean, obviously, we got, you know, go through uh, a lot of stuff tomorrow, um, you know, but uh, I think we're ready. You know. Have you started installing any of that? Anything you want to see? Not installing, but like working on things specific? We had, yeah, we had practice yesterday and we were working on some stuff, um, you know, and uh, we will. We, we talked about some things tonight, and we also, you know, we'll work on some things tomorrow. So yeah, we've been having fortunate to have that little bit of a, a runway. Torian was that purely rest purposes tonight? Yeah, you know, he just uh, just a little bothered, just wasn't feeling a hundred percent. So there was no point in pushing it. So. What's it like coaching tonight? Like it's third quarter on, like it's it's non rotation players and yet like the crowd kinda had like almost a playoff atmosphere too. Yeah, no, I mean I was it was great. I mean, you know, listen this is always said this is a, a great sports town. If you play hard and you play the right way and you do the right things, they'll come out they'll support you and those those guys did. They played defense, they fought, uh they made tough plays and you know, you know that's that's what we want to be. A lot more of that, a lot less of what we saw in the first half, but got a first second look at Greg Monroe yeah um, what, what did you what did you see from him tonight yeah he's gonna I mean, just to good, gives us something that we don't have you know like a legit big with size he's got pick and roll poise um you know his passing is really good and um you know you just when the ball's in his hand you feel pretty comfortable you know I thought he was you know um unfortunate there a little bit you know got caught in traffic a bunch but didn't benefit from anything but he yeah he played great it seems like you don't have to necessarily change up the way you're guarding. He was he was coming all the way out, like, like yeah, the, you know, he's Carl. pretty comfortable. He's pretty pretty comfortable being up there, um, and he's got you know he's got good good feel. You know, it's the hardest thing with like some of these different pick and roll coverages for young guys. They don't have the feel for him just yet. Chris, just eighty two games are done. Like overall, big picture, what, how do you feel about how this season went? Forty six wins. You know, a seven seed, depending on the play out, play in, but like just in general, what yeah. this team was able to accomplish. Yeah, I mean, obviously, we're really, really excited. You know, eleven games over five hundred. Um, you know, uh, got a big week ahead of us. Got a chance to get into the playoffs, which is uh, no one would have predicted at the start of the season, really, except our guys in the locker room. They talked about it on day one, so credit to them. It's a good first step. You know, this just needs to be the foundation of what we're trying to build, um, and uh, you know. Regardless of what happens from here, we've got a lot of things that we learned about ourselves that we can, you know, places we need to go and get better and things we need to do better. So that's the exciting part.